Hey guys, this is a demonstration of the finished iOS app for calculating power and audio transformers. It will be available very soon in the App Store. If you're interested in calculating your power and audio transformers, you can check the link in the description for the spreadsheet calculators and tutorials on my website. Here I'm calculating a power transformer for a tube stereo hi-fi amp that I will be building soon. It has been totally inspired by David's 6B4G stereo amplifier. You can check the detailed project he shared on his channel by following the link in the description. There are several dream projects I'm planning to make and I've been wishing to make them for several years now. This is one of the highest ones on the list. While saving the money for the project, I've decided to wind the power and output transformers since I have all the materials for winding on hand. This amplifier can be used with both 6B4Gs and 6L6s. The output transformers, which I will show you in another video, are wound for the Williamson circuit just in case I would like to use them with 6L6s. Originally, David used the Acrosound output transformers. My main goal is to use only the 6B4Gs, but I've also made the option for using the 6L6s since it doesn't require too much additional work. The nice thing about winding your own transformers is that you can really optimize it for the circuit you're working with. For example, I don't need the 5V winding since I'll be using the solid state rectifier, so that leaves more space for other windings. I can also use exact B plus voltage I want, which is another great thing. In this video you can see how much is involved in winding your own transformers. It's not really that complicated, but it can be a tedious and time-consuming process. There are many steps involved and you have to be really focused and not make any mistakes that you might regret later. A well-designed and made transformer can last virtually forever. It's easy to calculate with great precision and it's very flexible in operation. In the next video, I'll make the two ultralinear output transformers for this amplifier. Hopefully next month I'll be able to order the metal chassis, tube sockets, capacitors and other small parts. And then lastly I will need to order the tubes themselves. I also have the 6SN7 preamp tubes on hand, so I just need the quad of 6B4Gs. I would like to thank all my patrons for their ongoing support and I would especially like to thank David from El Paso Tube Amps for years of great content and inspiring videos and projects. Thanks for watching.